Hi everyone, and welcome to the first tutorial video of the Matchbox Restoration channel. A lot of people have asked me about the custom tool I use to secure the wheels onto the axles. Before I explain how to make this tool yourself, I want to make clear that I don't take any credit for this method. Many other restorers use a similar tool, I just want to share how I created mine. You'll only need a few things to make your own custom tool. A 2mm drill bit, that's a 1 16th inch drill bit if you use imperial units. A nail or screw or anything else as a base for the tool. You can basically use anything you can put into the drill press. And a center punch to make sure you start drilling at the right spot. Some people have spring loaded center punches, which are very easy to work with. I only have this large one, which also works perfectly for the job. Without preparing the nail or screw with a center punch, you'll probably end up with a tool like this. With the hole out of center, the tool will be useless when mounting it to the drill press. So after using the center punch on the nail or screw, you can secure it onto the vise of your drill press. You then use the 2mm or 1 16th of an inch drill bit to drill a tiny part, about 2mm, into the nail or screw. The regular wheel matchbox axles are a bit smaller in diameter, so 2mm or 1 16th of an inch will create a wider lip at the end of the axle. Don't drill too deep, as this will result in a tool that scrubs against the wheels when using it. And that's it. If everything goes to plan, you'll end up with a finished tool that is ready to use. Always make sure to properly mount the tool into the drill press. If it's out of center, it will wobble and create a mess. I used to have another tool with a larger hole drilled into it to hold the other side of the axle in place, but that seemed to deform the hub of the axle too much. That's why I'm using a piece of wood on the other side of the axle when using the tool. Please let me know if you found this tutorial useful and if you like some other methods explained in a bit more detail. Please hit the subscribe button to get notified when I'm uploading a new video. Also keep your eye on the community tab of my channel where I'll let you know what I'm working on. And as always, thank you for watching.